Researchers at the University of Nevada continue to test wastewater to track COVID-19 variants right here in our community. Yeah, it's pretty interesting stuff. They've identified and tracked the Delta variant through this method since June. Paul Nelson is live at UNR for us with the story. Paul, why is this type of research so important? Well, Ari, it really lets us know which variant of COVID-19 is most prevalent in our community. It's really another tool that they can use to really track this virus uh, really down to its variant. And the concentration of the Delta variant is also in line with the number of people who are testing positive for it. That definitely predicts that what variant might be coming or what variant might be increasing over time. And this is a good model to uh, estimate whether the variant belongs to a particular lineage or not. Researchers test wastewater from locations all over the Truckee Meadows on a daily basis, including the area's three wastewater reclamation sites. Testing for COVID-19 and the different variants allows them to see how prevalent the virus is about a week before it shows up through in-person testing for the virus. Since they take samples from different locations, they can also pinpoint what parts of town the virus is impacting more. This year we are a little more targeted. We are trying to find out at the community level, city of Reno level, city of Sparks level, what's happening in the communities. And officials say it's normal to have different bacteria and viruses in the sewage. And uh, really that's no different with COVID. The good news is that COVID-19 is not transmissible through the sewage and the virus cannot survive the wastewater treatment process before it goes back into the Truckee River. Covering the story live, Paul Nelson, 2 News.